to, to, to our questions from civil society. And I'd like to invite you to make perhaps your final remarks. Well, let me say this. Um, um, I'm ha very happy that we made a contribution from an executive side. Parliament made their contribution, the judiciary made their contribution, civil society, to the National Action Plan on Open Government. Because it is our collective responsibility as Kenyans to make sure that Kenya succeeds. It is not the business of the president alone, it's the business of every Kenyan for us to succeed. Because in that success is everybody's success. Let me also say the following, that um, as we do this, I want to assure all the stakeholders here that the government of Kenya that I run will continue to be open. I have absolutely no qualms in being held to account. I, uh, I, I encourage civil society to continue tell, telling us the things we are doing wrong so that we can correct. And to occasionally tell you the things you're doing right. Yes. I was waiting <laughs> for that to come. <laughs> and, and occasionally, you know, when we get things right, mm -hmm. they also tell us this you're getting right, do it better or do it more. So that way we can, we can forge, you know, a collaboration that makes Kenya great for all of us. Let me conclude by saying, because there is a feasible, demonstrable, real, trust gap between citizens and government across the globe. Yeah. You know, there, there is, you know, there, there is a, a trust deficit. There is a trust gap. I want to welcome you and the people here and representatives from our friends from the international community to a trust summit here in Nairobi, the first one in the first quarter of next year, oh. so that we can evaluate what do we do to close the gap, the trust gap between government and citizens. Because unless we do that, it becomes difficult for government to implement uh, its plan and for citizens also to hold government to account. Thank you. So put it in your calendars, quarter one next year, Trust Summit here in Nairobi. Mr. President, thank you so much for your time and good luck in Korogosho and in all your other duties. Thank you very much. Thank you, <laughs> thank you Asante.